Hey guys, welcome back. So today we got a 2023 GV80 3.5 liter. Customer complained that he got a warning message here in the cluster. It says low on oil. So and this one, I quickly checked this last time was oil level was good. Because it was just recently did an oil change. Not recently, but maybe two months, three months. So anyway, um, the levels, the level on the oil was good at full mark but the cluster shows a low level in oil so let's start it and show it okay so there's our warning light there and low engine oil even though the oil level is good so today we're gonna be replacing that sensor the oil level sensor um, it's a three wire sensor power ground and it's just a link communication so it's gonna be processed to the sensor itself and go to the communication line and go to our cluster or to the computer so whichever that goes but yeah, um, what we can do is we can plug in the new one and if there's no warning light like that, so it's the sensor, most likely it's the sensor issue since it's, um, we got good level, right? Unless um, if the communication line or power ground in there is open, right? I think that's the time we can get that um war warning message right but i checked it last time everything was plugged in power and ground is good and communication is there so as long as you check those three right um you should be fine so i'm gonna drain the oil and then install our new um sensor So here's our wiring diagram, if you follow my mouse, we got full time power there, B plus, we got ground and then communication and got that goes to our ECM. So let me show you the quick um, just check before we replace the sensor. Okay, so here's our oil level sensor. Um, I'm on ground and power for now, that's black and pink. So we're reading 14 volts there, so which is good. Now I'm gonna transfer our power lead to the lean communication. So that's gonna be our blue wire. And here's our communication. Let me just change the time based on this. So that's how it looks like the lean communication there. So that's gonna be at 14 volts to almost zero. Right? Um, let's see here. So that's 13.8 almost. Or more of 14. But that's how the, the signal or the pattern of the lean signal, right? So I'm gonna drain the fluid on this one, the oil. And then we can replace the sensor and check our cluster again okay so I just hold my three three bolts 10 mm Here's our new one.
then we'll just torque them to 10 foot pound. Clean this up. I'm gonna fill the oil, uh, fill the engine with oil, and then let's start the car and double check if it's leaking or not, and then that should be it. By the way, this is our part number for that oil level sensor 21590-2S000. Alright, guys, so I just filled up with oil. So far we don't have warning lights there, no triangle, I know it says here open hood but if there's a message there it will pop up but so far there's no warning message there. So let's just go underneath the vehicle and just double check that area, make sure that there's no leak. Alright so here's a, um, the new one, so far there's no leak there, which is good. So there you go guys, um, that's a quick replacement at least that's very quick there you just you just have to drain the oil and three bolts that's holding it and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed that video and see you next time thank you for watching